and the hits keep coming or make that the keys keep coming anyways guys I've got only a couple of books to show you so but they are pretty substantial in my view so um, come on back after the short video intro and we'll get right to them here we go we're back uh, comic sniper here once again thank you very much for joining me along with my trusty sidekick and uh, good buddy uh, Mark three my level of applying Iron Man. We thank you very much for joining my channel and uh, Can't wait to share just a couple of books. So not not a big haul today, but uh, I got these uh, one book I got from uh, Instagram community and the other one I got off of eBay, but definitely uh, I feel like I've been doing something right lately because uh, uh, You know, I've been uh, Considering myself pretty lucky to be able to find some of these books at uh, at the price I'm able to get them. So yeah, just uh, that's why I call it the the keys just keep coming because they're you know in my book uh, at least one of these is a really major key. Uh, the other one is a more of a personal key. Okay, and uh, so yeah here and without too much more to go into it, let's show you the first one. This one is. Here we go. This is the Amazing Spider-Man number 28. This is the first appearance of the Molten Man. Uh, it's not a terribly big, big key, uh, but to me, I've, I don't know why I'm having such a hard time uh, acquiring this book. It seems like it's um, it's always just out of my reach or somehow something happens and I, I can't seem to get this one, but uh, um, I saw somebody um, post this up on Instagram and I reached out and said hey you know if you're interested in moving that um, you know let's uh, maybe we can talk and definitely he was uh, he was open to that and uh, we struck a deal and uh, I'm pretty happy with with the with the deal definitely it's not a super high grade copy I was I was tempted to to wait you know uh, a lot longer for maybe a more decent copy of this book because as you can see you know ch the composition of this book um, especially with uh, with everything being black and how spider-man is just drawn in red it's just amazing I love this I love the way that's uh, it's done uh, by the way this is done by the uh, late great uh, Steve Ditko uh, which just passed away just recently and uh, we are we are going to be all of a loss uh, to lose one of the great ones, uh, one of the founding fathers, at least for us, uh, that gave us this great hobby. So yeah, so rest in peace, uh, Steve. Hopefully uh, uh, you done you done yourself great. Okay, so yeah, this and this is one of them. Now this one is not uh, high grade by any means. It um, the staples are all intact, barely. <laughs> It's I I opened this up already and it, it is hanging on uh, I would say by a prayer <laughs> so but you know we've got uh, we've got some marble chipping uh, that's usually indicative of uh, of an age of this book because it is in you know in the silver age uh, really early spider-man so but it does still have a lot of I've seen this I've seen this book you know get faded pretty easily since it's all black uh, and this book still has a lot of good uh, good dark colors on it so you know I am gonna be open to uh, getting a higher uh, higher uh, grade of this book but at least now I can kind of relax and uh, knowing that I have this in my collection because I'm trying to uh, fill a, um, a spider-man run uh, slowly slowly but surely all right so that's uh, I'm pretty happy with that definitely and uh, once again I uh, I always recommend guys uh, when when uh, if you're a collector uh, reaching out to the uh, Instagram community is always uh, recommended at least for me because I find that there's a lot of great people out there the same kind of people that uh, that actually I find on uh, on YouTube uh, and I actually follow them on Instagram as well and uh, they're able to you know post up a lot of their collection point of view that kind of stuff kind of you know a lot more than making a, 
a video because it's it's a lot more uh, to make a video than it is just to post up a picture and a few words on Instagram so yeah that's why uh, there's a lot more there and definitely a lot more people because not many people not that many people can uh, uh, will are willing to put the time in and the energy to put videos together so definitely um, recommend doing that because that's a great uh, source uh, for a comic book you know community and uh, and lots of great uh, lots of great things happening on uh, on Instagram and of course coming up next um, I was very happy to already cross this off my list my 2018 list uh, this year and when that happened uh, it took a really huge load off my shoulders because I you know was kind of hunting for it for again for a little while because I I gave up my copy early last year uh, I I was offered a really good deal and I just couldn't pass it up so uh, I, but I always want to make sure I have this in my possession and I was kind of sad to see it go uh, so I always told myself you know what um, keep keep a lookout that's why I put it into my 2018 list I was able to acquire it but then lo and behold the cat came back and I got a second copy of giant size x-men number one how cool is that and this is even a better copy than the one uh, i just acquired just recently and i was that i was able to cross that cross that off my list so you know it's just because i was able to um actually funny thing about this i was uh, i'm i'm actually re purposing my strategy as far as eBay is concerned I find that uh, there was a lot of good deals to be had when people are at work because <laughs> people do have to go to work and if you're if you happen to uh, you know and a lot not a lot of people can you know pay attention to their eBay account at that time and when people sometimes things are ending uh, right around the afternoon mark, you know, one o'clock, two o'clock, three o'clock, just before people um, get off work. Because sometimes in the morning, I find that uh, people, for whatever reason, I, I don't know, maybe it's time zones, uh, but, you know, of course, everybody looks forward to the evening, and you can tell that a lot of people are buying stuff and, and really paying attention to their to their watch list and the things that are ending right around the dinner time which is fine um, and of course uh, it's a hit and miss late at night you know sometimes I, I'll stay up if I if I can't get to sleep I'll, I'll pay attention to what's going on in, in, in the evening but of course you know not uh, there are only a few times that I've been able to uh, gain something out of that which is which is pretty good too but what I'm finding, and I'll give you that, this is my little secret and a little tip to all you guys, around the afternoon, if you're able to be, take a look at it, because a lot of people are at work, so they're not take, they're not really looking at their account. And whatever is ending at that time is sometimes, you know, people can't have to pass it up because they don't, uh, they're, they're not paying attention to their, so they're not, snipering uh, sniping that uh, that book that they want and so you can find keys and that's how I got this look at this this is pretty cool I mean it's not like super high grade uh, there is uh, of course you know spine stresses uh, there's some splits there is a there's a, a good little split there there's even uh, uh, a little a little piece missing there and of course you've got your usual suspects of creases the break color um, that kind of thing but the back is very similar to this so it you know I would put this probably in the I don't know the three uh, three to four range possibly I'm gonna I'm gonna work on this book a little bit see if I can't uh, flatten it out some more uh, not gonna be able to to uh, get uh, a lot of the of course there's no getting you know creases that uh, break color out um, and there is some some staining in this area right there which uh, depending on what it is uh, I might have luck I might not have luck getting that out uh, so we'll see and of course there's always a little bit of uh, tanning and a little bit of boxing so 
yeah it's not uh you know it's on the it's on the lower side of the grade for sure uh but dang you know for especially for what i paid for this uh i got it for quite a good steal especially since i you know at that time when i guess everybody's not everybody's at work so you know there were there's definitely ways to use the system and they use the um use you know things to your advantage uh depending on you know where you live uh what time you're able to uh, acquire things and and of course what system you use right so it teaches own in it and if you can uh work things out to make to take advantage of either or yeah you know more power to you i think uh I, there is a lot of great deals to be had out there so for me this is one of them great great grail i mean how can you how can you not love giant size x-men number one first appearance of a ton of characters colossus storm nightcrawler um uh his sister lalandra rasputin right thunderbird sorry for keep forgetting about thunderbird he's he's definitely there he's thunderbird of course second appearance of uh, second full appearance of wolverine first full appearance of the full of uh, the new x-men you know it's so much going for this thing it's unbelievable uh it's definitely a holy grail for a lot of people including myself so hope uh really happy to get have a second this is my second um copy of this the first one is a little bit lower grade because it has uh has some writing some silver maybe it's a sharpie i don't know uh on the on the x of the red and the, there's a few more uh, things as well so not too not too too bad that uh, you know if it, it, the other one is probably a two to two and a half maybe a three if uh, if if it's lucky you know because sometimes uh, on the lower grades there's a lot there's definitely a lot more that can go wrong in the comic book that allow for such a low grade definitely right so it's just a matter of the accumulation of those flaws uh, that uh, will determine whether you know CGC, CBCS, or PGX, whatever grade they decide to give it, uh, based on the flaws. All right. But uh, anyways, that's enough for me uh, for these two. But again, like I said, just uh, all I am just being patient because look what I got. That's awesome. Amazing Spider-Man 28 and Giant Size X-Men number one. That's fantastic can't believe I was able to pick up these two so uh, just so recently so okay so thank you very much for taking the time to uh, watch my video and uh, and gonna give a shout out to my new subscriber because you know guys I really appreciate you guys taking the time to uh, subscribe to my channel always appreciated you should see their names coming up uh, on there anytime um, and then, of course, uh, if you want your shout out on my future videos, no, nothing, uh, nothing special. Just subscribe to my channel, okay? And then, of course, uh, I would also appreciate you hitting that like button because that tells me lots of things. Like this is something you guys like to see, and that will definitely, you know, make me uh, get me to uh, make me know that I'm on the right track and that I should be making. Uh, more of these videos in the future as we do them well not this one because <laughs> well you never know I got to I got the second one uh, without you know really uh, really trying too hard because after I got the first one I was so relieved you know I just kept an eye out uh, I wasn't really actively looking for the second one and then of course um, uh, oh yeah just you know once you subscribe uh, and hit that like button don't forget to hit the notification bell because that'll remind you guys that'll tell you guys when the next video comes out so you don't miss those and of course your comments and your thoughts are always welcome on my channel and I highly recommend you, you know putting something down let me know if you do like uh, what you're seeing what you what you would like to see more of in the future as far as future videos so that uh, uh, and I always appreciate you guys leaving any comment and I just want to uh, take the time to answer back to okay so that's it for me guys uh, and while you guys are out there uh, searching for those, you know, either personal or holy grail keys, guys, just make sure you enjoy the hunt. So Comic Sniper signing off along with my good buddy, 
Mark III. Thank you very much. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.